like that. See, I, I prop, it's just, saw sign means to block or to prop something. And that's exactly what I'm doing on his ankle here. I'm Very strong hip rotation. And the foot prop is the last action in the movement. So go ahead and toss it. Okay, we're going to take a look at a very interesting way to do um, Sasai Surikomiyashi. You might even turn it into Harai Surikomiyashi. And it's one I picked up off my good friend John Saylor. It's, it's, it's a lot of use of the hip movement. It's, it's a really good Taisabaki action here, and this is why it works. So what we're going to look at here is when you're pulling it, and the grip, we're going to get a back grip here. Can you see that? All right. And I, I want to pull this into me. And when I start, my starting position is my right hip is very close to his hip. So there's not much space here. It's a very short, compact grip type situation. And when I, when I pull Derek into me, I'm going to literally pull him into my hip. See, I'm going to pull him right into my hip. And he's going to be pulling onto my right hip. My right hand pulling onto my right hip. Now, you notice I've looked my little Diashi action here, my sugar foot here, my foot. I'm doing it back. Okay, now, I'm switch position. So you can see my sugar foot here, my lead foot is here. Okay. When I pull him onto that lead hip, my left foot's going to step around slightly. Not a big, huge step. A nice little turning circular Taisabaki type move, like this. And you, you see that I'm, I'm pulling him onto me. And I'm pulling with my right hand, I'm pulling him into my hip in this position here. So as I do this, I just pull in here. And then when I do that, look at this, let's turn around this way. Watch the foot. When I set up on this, watch my foot. Like that. See, I, I prop, it's just, Sasai means to block or to prop something. And that's exactly what I'm doing on his ankle here. I'm blocking his ankle. Now, sometimes you may get a little more step, deeper step into it. You may actually put a sweep into it, more of a harai surikomiyashi. Either way, it's a very good throw. This is one of those things where you're probably going to have to go full bore, you're going to be landing on it because it's, it's very much a, it's almost like a sutemi waza or sacrifice throw away. A lot of turn in the hips. So when I'm, when I'm pulling it in here, it's, like it's, it's really hard not to throw them. But you see that it's, it's all hip rotation. Close, tight body space, very strong hip rotation, and the foot just blocks. It literally is a sasai action, a blocking or stopping action. So we're going to have the guys here do it. Watch Derek, are you in the right side or left? Right side? So when he gets, and important on the grip, everybody, is when he gets this grip, he wants his fist this way. He doesn't want to grab this way over the shoulder. He wants sideways. So he's around the deltoid here. And so he can pull with his hand Eric's body right into his hip. And see how there's no space there. And that's really important. So, see, because he's leading with his right foot and he just pulls him right in there. Now, as he pulls him in, he's going to step around and see very strong hip rotation. And the foot prop is the last action in the movement. So, go ahead and toss it. That's it. It's a full bore. You got to go for it. You know, Sutemi Waza. You know, it's full Makakomi. One more time at normal speed. Can you do that? Okay. There you go. Now, if you want to put a little more sweep into it, he could, but the prop really does the trick. It really, I don't want to say trick, does the job. So, can you, can you just maybe actually a little more sweep into it? Let me do it. Yeah. There you go. And you see how the finish, as he's finishing, he, it's a complete rotation of the body. It's a strong torque, a lot of torque with the hips and the upper body, and I end chest to chest on the guy. You don't want to end up twisting your body. Your body turns this way, you don't want to twist back. Okay, so that's very important. It's not like a classic, where you become like a, 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 a classic foot prop action where you turn. This is kind of the opposite. In fact, is, I may be using this grip, but I'll switch to this, and I'm pulling this side, and then I step. It, it's kind of a no space Sasai Sudakomiyashi is what it is. So can you do one more time here? Is that grip? Close it. There you go. You see each time it pulls them right in. One more time. Don't throw them. Just pull them into your head. So watch. Like I said, it's a no space Sasai Sudakomiyashi. Because when he pulls them in, he pulls them in right to his hip. You see there's no space. And that's it. 
And then there's a lot of hip rotation, and that's what throws them out. He was nice enough to land over there, but that's the idea. So it, this, it's a, it's, if you think of my pulling your hand right to your body, pulling them onto your hip, and that's, that's the rotation, that's the action. I want to get here, and as I do that, I turn. So as I pull here, I spin, and I prop. And there you have it. It's a, it's a very strong, fully, totally committed body throw. I mean, it's, 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 it is a Satimi Wadza, really. You might get me, you have to. It's just a type of rotation. And it's a, uh, kind of like, like I said, a, a, a no-space, south-side, So there we have it.